why, why are we uh, here today and to talk about culture safety and how do you lead it? Uh, I've been very fortunate in my business, uh, and it's not my business, it's a partnership, so I shouldn't be so possessive, but uh, very passionate about safety because for us, as much as there's a lot of compelling arguments to engage in safety because of the regulations, uh, the legal uh, requirements, um, criminal uh, <coughs> exposure as it relates to C45, the West Ray Mine uh, legislation, uh, those are compelling arguments. But for us, at least in, in our company, and I think largely in our industry, we do it because it's the right thing to do. In our business, being competitive, it, it, we're in a very fierce business when it comes to uh, competition, no different than I'm sure Paul experiences in the bus building business, but uh, competition is fierce. So productivity, quality, and safety are sort of the three tenets that uh, we, we try and work around. And we don't sacrifice one for the other. I know a lot of people say, well, safety first. In our business, production and quality have to move together with safety. We, 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 we can't really elevate one without sacrificing the other. They're, it's an integrated uh, uh, process. And uh, if, if, if we're not successful at safety, uh, injuries could go up, our, our losses. Uh, we talk about safety in loss prevention terms, and, and it's not just about injury to people and lost time associated with that, but it's, it's loss of any kind. It could be a damage to a piece of equipment. It could be damage to property. It could be damage to the environment. Loss is loss, and uh, you know it's hard to get back. Uh, time lost is lost forever, so to speak, and I think that's a adage that many people uh, understand. But um, <clears throat> anyways, where I was going, we, we, we promote a system where safety is important, but so is productivity. We've got objectives. We've got targets, we've got to meet them, but we can't sacrifice one for the other.